Eight men and one woman are in custody after FBI raids in three states, including Ohio. Investigators say the group planned to violently overthrow the government in the name of Jesus Christ. Two of the men were from our area. News Channel 5's Dan Haggerty has details this morning from Cleveland's FBI branch. Dan, good morning. Hey, uh, good morning, Kim. Morning, everybody. Uh, two of these members, again, from here locally, part of what the FBI is calling this Christian militia group, uh, planning terrible things, uh, according to their website and the FBI against some law enforcement officers. Take a look at the pictures from uh, the people here locally. They arrested 33-year-old Jacob Ward. He's from Huron. 27-year-old Christopher Sickles. He's from Sandusky. Hatari's website has videos that show a group of well-trained masked people with high-powered weaponry. Uh, according to the website, the word Hatari means Christian soldier. The feds say the group had plans to use weapons like these as well as IEDs, improvised explosive devices, uh, to incite an armed conflict with local, state, and federal law enforcement. Uh, according to law enforcement, the plan was to kill law enforcement officers and then attack their funerals. Investigator Dwayne Pullman uh, talked to Christopher Sickles' wife about the arrest. Here's what she had to say. It's a very big misunderstanding. Okay, He's do had you wanna... nothing to do with this. My husband has spent maybe 25 hours with them in the last five years with these people. Tell me, it's a big misunderstanding. He doesn't even know these people. My husband doesn't even know them. Well, how do you meet them? Through the Internet. How else? The FBI says the militia group was based out of Michigan. Again, nine people were arrested from Michigan, Indiana, and Ohio. Neighbors in Sandusky and Huron called both the men arrested there quiet and nice, but Warden Sickles could face up to 45 years in prison for any involvement in this. Uh, of course, we'll continue to keep you updated. Coming up in the next uh, 15 minutes or so, we'll have another hit. We'll show you uh, the rest of these people who were arrested. For now, reporting live in Cleveland, Dan Haggerty, News Channel 5. A famous